I don't know, man. Three videos <laughs> in one day. Um, yeah, Monday, Monday TTM returns. I got three. And one of them, I had to sign for it. Coming back from Nogueira Academy in Brazil. And then I got... I'm not sure where this one's coming from. But it's overseas. I'm trying to get the postmark there. Los stamps. I don't know. Let's see what this. It's from Europe. Yeah, it says it's got Europe on the stamp. And then this one is coming back from American Top Team. And then I did get a heads up about potentially getting two packages or packages or no packages or some packages or something from Mr. Card Cutter. I'm calling you the guru, dude. Guru Garrett. I don't know about that Cletus stuff, but Garrett, you're Guru Garrett to me, dude. Double G. Um, I didn't. I got two packages here, and I'm like looking at them. They got eBay stuff on them. One of them's like from Illinois. Another one's coming from like Florida. And then I'm like, man, this is there's no giveaways on here. But then all of a sudden I see. Um, in my in my address it says care, care of uh, Garrett so I'm guessing there's some buku stuff in here so and he did tell me to get my stamps ready so I will be taking donations for stamps <laughs> uh, yeah so I don't know not really taking donations but anyways and so Get off my back, Mr. Trent. I did get, I do have my shinger in hand since the last package, I, I guess, was kicking my butt. So let's start off with the American Top Team TTM return. Feels pretty thick. Got, got a few cards in here. Hopefully, it's something good. Coming back in my team bag. Man, this was quick. Not even a team bag. It's like. Um, the bag for all the penny sleeves for 100 penny sleeves. Uh, it's Glover Teixeira. I had just shown him in the TTM, re TTM return in my last video. These are all coming back real nice and in, in, in black. Um, and the reason why I had to send is kind of Trent's fault because he sent me this card. The Bedazzle Fractor of the 2013 Finest. That is solid as it comes right there. I'm glad to finally... And then this one has a little bit of rubbing from the back of this card, but not bad. That one will definitely be in a collage. So now I actually have the silver one of these is for trade, and then I have one signed in a fine point black, and then I had this one ready to send out too. So uh, this is my first one of these signed. So now I'm officially done with Glover Teixeira. Uh, all good signatures on all the cards I wanted done, and only a couple extras. Uh, I think the one, only ones I have duplicates of is this one. It's just the base 2013 finest. So if you want to trade or if you want it, you guys let me know. One's in silver and one's in fine point black. Sharpie. Um, so yeah, those will be my extras now. So that's cool. Let's see here. Let's leave the unknown Europe one for later. For last. Let's do the, uh, the one coming from Brazil. Look at all these stamps and a little bit of certified action. But yeah, it's got the address written on the back. So I'm thinking this is going to be Little Nog because he tends to write that size and his R is familiar. I've sent to him before um, and didn't have any luck so I sent off again just using plain um, number 10 envelopes instead of a 6x9 and I'm using postage stamps instead of um, alright, oh these are great wow sweet real real nice he doesn't have a landscape card but this is awesome. Really cool. Uh, thanks, David. I appreciate you. And as soon as possible, uh, I'll do a good fight for you and all my fans. God bless you, uh, Rogerio Nogueira. He's known as Little, Little Nogueira or Little Nog. Here's him and his brother. Um, Little Nog is on this side right there. So, yeah. I'm really hoping um, to get Paul Harris for my round four set through that gym as well. So it's good to know that my mail is make, making it over there and uh, sign these two cards really, really nicely in blue. 
blue sharpie. Here's a 2013 Bloodlines base card. And then, um, I can't get enough of these Moment of Truth cards. Just beautiful autograph, beautiful cards. So, um, still needing a bunch of, a few more uh, Moment of Truth landscape oriented, oriented cards. I did get that one in the last video, um, the Joseph Benavides. So that'll be a nice update. I think I need two or three more just to make the collage look the way I want it. I gotta show you guys some of these collages so you guys know what I'm talking about or how they look or whatever. I'll show you guys that sooner or later. All right, let's go for for this one. This could be from Sweden, could be from the UK. We shall see. Oh, nice. This is a training partner of uh, Alexander Gustafsson. This is who I thought it might be. Late reply, this is quick. Um, I hope he saved the card I sent for him to, to keep. But uh, Latifi, signed two of two. Real nice, quick return. Back and forth from overseas. He's training at All Star Training, All Stars Training Center in Sweden. Got a nice note back from him as well. Look at all this. I'm not going to read it, but there's that. Um, hey, he's saying again, like, uh, I'm sorry for, uh, I, I guess I will read it. I'll take that back. Dear David, I'm sorry for the late reply. I've been in hard training before this fight. Thank you so much uh, for your letter and the support. It's much appreciated. Here are the cards and signed. Uh, hope you're not offended by the delay. Thanks again. Um, that's a really nice signature down there, Latifi. So I keep all the notes and stuff like that. They all go into like a binder page. And uh, but no, these are freaking really nice. Um, yeah, another one for the landscape collage, of course. So now what? We're at 53. So that that was cool. Two overseas returns on a Monday, and overseas returns are usually on Tuesdays for me, just the way my post office sorts stuff. So. Um, I should be happy with that. Not think about the ones I didn't get that other people have gotten. But here we go. Uh, at this point, I'm going to turn it over to opening the package. Packages. So, I think I'm going to flip the camera around. So if you guys want to bow out now, you can go ahead and do that. So I think there's going to be just a bunch, a bunch of cards in here is what it feels like. Here's a Lego tree. <laughs> That's awesome. I uh, was not expecting this. It's actually a sealed set of PGA cards. Wow. Garrett, you the man, dude. I made reference to, uh, in my comment, I was going to start, I was going to PGA, I was going to TTM PGA cards, and I went to a card shop to see if they had any uh, PGA base cards, thinking, hey, card shops have tons of cards, right? Look at it, 1990. But uh, 1990 PGA tops, uh, pro set actually, not tops. And I used to watch golf with my grandpa in the 80s. I used to go over there for the weekends and stuff and just veg out with him and watch golf a ton. And there's just tons and tons of uh, PGA golfers um, that, that I remember and I know they're in this set. Wow, Garrett, you rock, dude. Oh yeah, Hale Irwin's right off the top, rest in peace. See, so, yeah, look at these bad boys, I gotta take half the stack. Hale Irwin, Tony Armour, Tom Yarner, Tom Watson, Tom Kite, Kenny Perry. This is kind of in, right in Steve Jones. S sort of really good timing to send out some of these. I got him before TTM. He actually won the Masters um, the year I was born. Uh, Payne Stewart passed away. So yeah, a lot of these guys. I watched a lot of these guys as a kid. Marco Mira, Calcavecchia, Lauren Roberts, Larry Mize. Man, there's some great stuff in here. 
Sluman, these guys like this, Ian Baker Finch, wow, the shark, Greg Norman. So, uh, Garrett, hooking it up big time. Thanks a lot, dude. And I'm guessing that the, the other ones, see how many cards are in here, 100. So that's what you meant by get my stamps ready. <laughs> oh, dude, that's a lot. That's a lot of cards. I'll do a little bit of those, that's for sure. Masters is coming up. Send out to the Masters locker room. All right. Oh, killing the camera. Package number two. Oh, man. Away what it was. What? What is going on? Oh, moment of truth set? Holy cow. Oh, man, if I ever needed any moment of truth cards, I got them now, man. Dang. Garrett, what the heck, dude? You're out of control. Out of control, double OC, dude. I assume you got one for yourself too, right, buddy? <laughs> That's awesome. These cards are so nice. There's all, there's not that many I still need, but I definitely need Johnny Bones Jones. Maybe somebody got him for me at the uh, Arnold Classic this weekend. Need Fabio, Dennis Seaver. I should be getting him. Matt Mitrione, need to get that one done. Robbie Lawler, great card. Fight coming up. Benavides, just got him. Pettis, look at that. Claude Patrick, super, tip, super tough to get. Really like Dana White. Wow, dude. Got to put this one away for Marshall. Great stuff here, Yanni. Gonna give that one away. Dung Young Kim. Cantwell's been super tough to get. So these are some good stuff in here to kind of reload and try again. Uh, Diego Nunes. Sorry, you're off. I was off camera. Give that one away. Man, I haven't had this many cards from the moment of truth forever. Awesome. These can definitely be thrown into a bunch of TTMs I got going out. That guy. <laughs> One can only hope or dream that he'd sign TTM. Man, moment of truth set. I think there's what? These are all on the number. I think there's 180? No, 220. Oh, man. It's really, really fun giving gifts. Receiving gifts is tough, but Garrett, you rock, buddy. Appreciate it. I'm sure we're going to have some TTM fun together, and uh, that's that. So, oh, man. Ended on a bang, that's for sure. Just a bunch, a bunch of base cards here. It's just awesome. So, uh, you guys have a great week, and hopefully we'll be back again soon with more TTMs and stuff. So, see you later.